Holy hell's about to finally get this beak plucked. The Dr. Gavami. We're, we're going to hook this nose up. So snobbish. <laughs> Man of the hour. The magical Dr. Gavami. You're going to look amazing. Seriously. He might even be my man. Oh, Lord, the things that pretty girls do to be even prettier. I, I can never for the life of me understand why women would basically put themselves through torture for beauty, especially when you're as good looking as Hazel E was before the damn surgery. It just makes no sense. But before I read to you what she had to say about this on Instagram, let me just say this. All of you people who slandered her name and said that she hurt herself in Dubai on purpose, falling on an an ATV, an all-terrain vehicle, so that she could get her nose fixed, I guess you were wrong. She really had a real accident. I just wanted to put that out there because people were being ridiculous, making up stories about her. She was actually injured on the ATV. And without further ado, here's what she had to say about this on Instagram. She said in a quote, this was an intense surgery, but I'm in recovery doing okay. Had to extend the stay because of extreme dehydration, but Dr. Gavami's on his way to come visit, end quote. So here's the deal, man. I can understand, you know, I mean, she's in Hollywood and whatnot, and she wants to look her best. Okay, I get it. So you go and you have a rhinoplasty or a nose job. Now, I made a video about how Portia Williams from The Real Housewives of Atlanta season eight got a nose job and a needle. They have this procedure where they can just inject a needle into your nose, shoot some stuff in it, some juice. I don't know what the stuff is, you know, excuse me for being ignorant. And it will transform your nose in front of your eyes. It, it actually transforms the shape of your nose with just a needle. And now don't get me wrong. I think that that's extreme too. But to have your nose removed or however they do it, reshaped breaking bones in your face and stuff like that I mean that's just it's scary to me to think about somebody cutting your face open and removing bones and reach I mean it, it just sounds really extreme and it's like Hazel was such a good looking woman like why in the world would she ever need a surgery like that I mean she's a pretty girl but, you know, like I said, you know, she's over there in Holly Weird and Holly Weird will make you do some strange things, Jesus. You know, don't sleep on Holly Weird. A lot of you women will probably say, I never get this or that done. Yeah. Take your butt to Hollywood and see how fast you change your mind. I mean, you're in a sea of dimes. Love and hip hop New York. Fine women. Love and hip hop Atlanta. Fine women. Love and hip hop Hollywood. Whole nother level. Those women I love hip hop Hollywood are off the freaking chain, you know. But yeah, anyways, I digress. Hazel E was a pretty girl. I guess she'll feel prettier now that, you know, she's gotten this surgery. I hope that she doesn't do anything else to her pretty face. Uh, anyways, not only am I a Hazel E fan, I'm also very thirsty. So, of course, you know, I like the way that she looks. And I wouldn't want her to change anything about all of that pretty. Anyways, let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine.